close out this hour with one last story I hope will bring joy to your day. This is what I'm liking. A Chicago artist got tired of seeing potholes on the streets of his neighborhood, so he came up with a very creative solution, mosaic art, super cool. Not only are mosaics long lasting, his works are truly beautiful. Now he fills the potholes around the world with his tiling, designing everything from animals to food to recreations of masterpieces hanging at the Art Institute of Chicago. He's incredible, so we have him on the line right now. Let's say hi to Bakker watching on NBC Chicago at three, everybody. <laughs> What's up, Bakker? Hey, Kelly. You are a super gifted man. It's it's such a rad idea. What what? How did you come up with the idea? Well, you know, it all started with an initial trip to Italy back in the late late 1990s. Um, I kind of fell in love with ancient um, art or ancient ancient ruins and whatnot. And so when you do that, you run across ancient mosaics, and ancient mosaics are made with marble and glass, and marble and glass don't fade. So the art looks the way the artist intended 2,000 years ago. And so that that thought, to this day, kind of drives my artwork. Um, so like, you know, currently I, I, I do fine art stuff that I sell on my website and I do commissions and whatnot, but it was really the pothole art that, that's, that, that caught fire. And that was back in uh, May of 2013. Uh, there were bad, bad potholes in Chicago that, that particular year, and especially on our street. And there was one stubborn pothole in front of our house um, that would get fixed, and then three months later, the asphalt would pop out, and they'd have to get fixed again and whatnot. And so I started thinking um, the juxtaposition of this art form I was so passionate about that was so durable with this unsolvable problem outside of our house. And uh, so what I decided to do one night, and I did it at night because I wasn't sure if it was legal or not, is <laughs> I went out there with some concrete and a piece of mosaic art, and I fixed that pothole. And so what happened from there is that it just kind of blew up. Um, people love them. I ended up doing, uh, I've done over a hundred now at this point, most of them are in Chicago, but a lot of them are around the country. And there's even a couple international in uh, like internationally in like Finland and Italy. That's so cool. And just helping your city look cooler. It's like, you're not just filling the pothole, yeah. you're creating something beautiful too in, in the same moment. Thank you so much, Bakker. I'm liking your post right now, right? Chris, thank you. And that's not all, my man. Our season-long partner, Pilot Pin Makers, a G2, the go-to pin of the Kelly Clarkson Show, want to honor truly unstoppable and creative people just like you, sir. So they're going to be writing you a check for $1,000. How's that sound? Oh, that's unexpected. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much, Bakker. Thank you to all our guests this hour, Brian Cranston, Rita Wilson, Chef Katie Chen. Y'all have a great day, and if it's not, try and change it.